it's the family dynamic between the four of them is that should something like what happened in Woodsboro happen again, at least they have each other to sort of rely and support each other through. Um, I'd say for Chad specifically, he's not entirely autonomous without the presence of his sister. Um, so I think anywhere she goes, he's more than happy to follow. Uh, coupled that with the fact that he has uh, a deep love for Tara and uh, immense amount of uh, admiration, respect, and love for Sam as well, it only made sense that he would make sure that he was present wherever they were. New York adds an element of agency and higher octane level of pace um, that vastly exceeds maybe the other films just by virtue of the lifeblood of what New York City is. It's very uh, fast moving, very um, high intense <laughs> sort of locale that I think perfectly embodies like what the sixth inst installment of Scream is and should be. Jasmine is not only the older sister, despite the fact that we play twins, I'm talking now in personal relation, the older sister and maternal force in my life that when I'm away from my everyday atmosphere of like being home in LA, I look to her for both grounding as well as social tutelage and like what it's like to sort of be comfortable in groups of people that maybe I haven't spent a ton of time with. She's a safety net on and off set. She's always there to talk. She's a great cook, great singer. Jenna is constantly teaching me things every day. And I think it'd be an easy compliment to say she's one of the smartest, most uh, intelligent, insightful, and overwhelmingly beautifully composed person I've ever met both on and off camera in a way that's just inspiring to be around. I have to imagine the overwhelming amount of excitement and exuberance directed entirely to having Kirby make an appearance has to, you have to want to appeal and excite fans enough to not only consider, but actually follow through and bringing back a questionable Lee faded character like Kirby, because I think it was obviously ambiguous for a reason. We brought in Kirby only to me speaks to how dedicated this movie, this production, Radio Silence, uh, Six Cream in general is to making sure that the fans have a good time. Matt and Tyler make it fun to be an artist. I think moreover than working with them deliberately on set, it's the moments even leading up to filming where I felt like I could ask them anything about the script, about their process, about what we were maybe to expect when we got to Montreal that allow me to feel safe and uh, comfortable collaborating once we actually get here. They are absolutely artist first and they make sure that the process is both understandable and productive as possible. I, I, I could speak highly about them for hours, but whatever instruction they give you on set or whatever direction that they have for you, it's always pushing, moving the needle forward. I'm always feeling like I'm getting better and I'm closer to Chad every time I speak to them. So for what it's worth, I think they're great at their jobs.